is up, everybody? This is Michael Miner. I'm doing this loud and proud. This is your BWC Wrestle War 4 post show. I'm doing a redo of the post show from last night. Um, pretty and Jack, so pretty sorry that it was pretty low. Um, I'm going to try to get some light here. You guys can still see me. Pretty, pretty, should be pretty like that because, uh, because of the sun. So, uh, pretty much, pretty much the way it's going to look like for now. Um, ladies and gentlemen, let's, um, pretty much I want to thank, uh, Pretty and Jax for having me at BWC, at BWC Wrestle War 4. Was an incredible pay per view last night. This is pretty much a redo for the BWC Wrestle War 4 post show. Um, I apologize that the volume was pretty low because my uncle was pretty much sleeping and I didn't want to do it too loud to, so, you know, wake him up, you know, and stuff like that. So, uh, let's get into our first match as we had a six man elimination battle royale. It was Gregory Vasquez versus Kevin Girk versus. Ian Miller versus The Law versus Bomber versus Bam Colbert. What an incredible match between these four. These one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. These six incredible superstars. Um, pretty much your winner of that match was The Law. What an incredible match. That is a four out of five. What an incredible match between those two. Ladies and gentlemen, let's get into the main card. That pretty much was a squash match. You could just put that and just drop it into a like a pit and say bye bye to it. Um, pretty much, I'm sorry for the uh, the lighting. Um, pretty much, I got sunshine outside. It's sunny out here. Let me try and fix this. to the right, oh, 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 there we go, here I am, hello, <laughs> sorry about that guys, I had to get my lighting quality, let me go close that window here, sorry to do this, you know, I should have been prepared to do this, but I can see my screen, so, let's see if we got me now, everybody see me now, ah, there we go, better lighting, if it does, I can have it fixed, there's a little button on there on the YouTube that says if you have something to do with your lighting quality, I'll just push yes, fix it. Um, pretty much let's get into our second match. It was for the BWC United States Heavyweight Championship. It was the champion himself, Nighthawk, against Link. What an incredible match these two had. It was a back and forth, back and forth. I pretty much uh, didn't get to see... Um, yeah, I think it was this one or some other match. I didn't get to see all of it. Um, pretty much that was a great match between these two superstars. Your winner and still BWC United States Heavyweight Champion is Nighthawk. Congratulations, Nighthawk. In our third match, um, Darnell Anderson against Lamont, the greatest Williams. Um, pretty much Darnell... Let me tell you something. You come around thinking, I know you're a veteran. I know you're a veteran in the BWC roster, but you, let me tell you something. When I become a BWC massacre superstar on the roster, I want to take you on. You see, you crazy little face-painted freak. Yeah, you're a clown freak. Like you always are there now. But ladies and gentlemen, you're winner. By Stone Cold Stun. You got Stone Cold Stunner, Darnell. Why are you talking shit? And you want to do a dip step. Whatever the fuck that is, you can kiss my ass with that. But, ladies and gentlemen, your winner is Lamont, the greatest Williams. My favorite wrestler. Ladies and gentlemen, we get into our fourth match. It was a first blood match for the BWC Bloodlust Championship. It was Tomahawk coming in as the champion versus Matt Maverick. Our 
me and Elrod's first victim that we're going to take out when we become superstars of the BWC Massacre. Um, really pretty good match. Um, pretty good back and forth match. And Tama, um, Matt Maverick has draw first blood, so your winner of the match. And still, BWC Bloodlust champion is Tomahawk. What an incredible match. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, we get into our fifth match. It was the Money in the Bank match. Winner gets a future shot for the BWC World Heavyweight Championship anytime he pleases. We've had the Tornado, the Hurricane wannabe. Let me back up here so we so you don't have to like always do face like this. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so you guys don't see my full face, but or see the whole me. Um pretty much um it was the tornado versus Dark Phantom versus Sasuke Uchiha versus Nightmare versus Beast Mode versus Magnum Storm. Um pretty much I cheered for uh, Sasuke Uchiha because of what he did last week at BWC Massacre against Scorpio when he won the ladder match become $25,000 richer. Um, but it was a pretty good back and forth ladder match. Um, your winner of that match was Beast Mode. He is the winner of the 2013 Russell War 4 Money in the Bank ladder match. All right, let's get into our match number six. It was for the BWC Cruisers Championship as the Incredible D. As the champion versus Alex Wood. Wow. What a great match between these superstars. Alex Wood coming in as a uh, pretty much a rookie or a veteran. I can't remember if he's a rookie or a veteran. But he's coming in here. You know, he's trying to prove himself. Um, to me, Alex Wood did an incredible job just proving himself. But he lost by a short pin. Your winner of the match is the Incredible D. He is still your BWC Cruiser champion. Ladies and gentlemen, we get into our seventh match, my kind of match, the Six Bay Tag Team Match. It's the Blaze Sisters and Jojo Salgado versus Marissa Chaos Shaw, uh, Shay, and Sasha Fierce. What an incredible match between these ladies. Jojo Salgado coming in as a first time in BWC Wrestle War 4. What an incredible match for this young girl. Let me turn this light off here. I think it's pretty much good. Uh, light should stay up for now. Sorry about that, ladies and gentlemen. Just trying to get used to lighting eras. Pretty much light is in my bedroom. But I'll get used to it. Um, pretty much your winners of the matches, Marissa Chaos, Shai, and Sasha Fierce. We get into our eighth match. It is a steel cage match. It's Lucifer versus Dante. These two have been in a feud together since uh, Lucifer. I don't know if he came as a Dark Phantom, uh, Dark Asylum guy, but uh, Dante lost the steel cage. It was inside a Attitude Era black cage. It was an Attitude Era black cage. I remember a match inside that black cage. It was um, Stone Cold Steve Austin against Vince McMahon. I can't. Oh, Saint. I think it was Saint Valentine's Day Massacre. I think it was the winner. If Stone Cold Steve Austin could beat Vince McMahon, he would get the shot at WrestleMania. And Stone Cold won the match by Paul White just grabbing, picking him up, and throwing him right through the right through the cage. And the cage just popped over, and he just dropped to the floor. But your winner of the steel cage match is Lucifer. Lucifer is getting into being the devil himself. Ladies and gentlemen, we get into our ninth match. Um, pretty much this was an, an emotional match to me. It was a shocker to everybody. Everybody wanted to see Shaw Ray win this. A lot of critic people wanted to see Pandora win. I didn't want to see Pandora. I wanted to see, see Shaw Ray win this. So I could have her at ringside for my first debut match. It would be an honor to have her as my first, as the lady to be, to in, you know, introduce me into the ring. Um, pretty much your winner of that match and still BWC Bay's champion. 
um, is Pandora. I mean, Shaw Ray just left the ring. I mean, she was pretty burnt. She was pretty hurt. Uh, when she was injured, she was trying to get some of that attention ready for her last match or in the main event of the evening. Um, but, ladies and gentlemen, let's get into our 10th match. It was a 2 out of 3 fall. Both count anywhere. This is the one I didn't get to see because I think I was pretty much, I had to, had to restart my computer. My computer was acting up, kept freezing up, so I had to restart my computers, and I pretty much missed that match. I got, like, into half of Jackson and PWX and hitting that one. Um, I asked the guys who won that match. The winner of that match was Joshua Penrod. Congratulations, jo uh, Joshua Penrod, for being a PM, a PK Puke, uh, I mean PK Punk. Um, but you did a very good job, Joshua Penrod. You finally got over being with this PK Puke. Sorry, it's PK Punk. I'm so sorry if I get your name wrong, PK Punk. Because you are a PK Punk. I don't know what your PK stands for, but I think it might be uh, Punk Kills Punk. That could be. <laughs> but, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, we get into our 11th match. It's an Extreme Rules match for the BWC Backbreakers Championship. This one was the match of the year. These two last matches are, I think, going to be in the match of the year uh, contention. For like they could do like a 2013 Slammy Awards or BWC Massacre Awards, um, if they would have Match of the Year, these two matches would be in there. It was Jax coming in as the BWC Backbreaker Champion versus BWX, and your winner and new BWC Backbreakers Champion is BWX. After the match, BWX pretty much gave respect. Back to Jax, I clap that to you, DWX. You did an incredible job in that match, Jax. You did too. You've got those Hulkamaniacs right there in front of you for you. Well, it was pretty much a short limb, but you will become champion again. I would love to see the rematch. Um, now we get into our main event of the evening. It was for the BWC World Heavyweight Championship. The, uh, Hammer as the champion versus Scorpio versus the first time ever a women's a woman in the division coming in to face these two big guys. You got Hammer six foot eight, I think it's seven foot eight, dude, and you got Scorpio, the big fat chubby guy. You know, pretty much eats every time he goes backstage. That's pretty much his exercise. He eats and but um. Mm. I was like, beat those dinosaurs, Mark. We can get in here in a little bit here. Um, your winner and new BWC World Heavyweight Champion. I pretty much got a hug from Sha Ray. Is Sha Ray? She is your new BWC World Heavyweight Championship. Um, pretty much, I thought maybe Beast Mode would have come in and cash in the Money in the Bank, but I think he's pretty much waiting on that. Um. He pretty much wants to see Hammer come back as champion, then cash it in on him. But pretty much, um, I thank you very much, uh, BWC Wrestle War 4. This will be my moment here of the year of 2013. Um, I would put, um, I put BWC Raw for it all in number two, and I put Wrestle War 4 in my number one spot because, ladies and gentlemen, BWC Massacre was the greatest show ever, and I thank you very much, Jax, Pretty, thank you so much. I hope to God I get into the BWC roster, and I hope to get to headline BWC Wrestle War 5 coming up next year. We don't know what the city is. I hope someday they'll do an announcement of where BWC Wrestle War 5 is going to be. It'd be awesome to be Somewhere in Milwaukee, I know it's the arena in the WWE 13 game, but it would be awesome. Um, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for tuning in to the BWC Wrestle War 4 pro post show. This is a redo of the show from last night. I apologize for the low volume. I apologize for the low voice. Um, just hope this is pretty loud now. Um, I'll check the video and see if it is pretty loud. Um, I want to thank you for watching. 
Um, I know I've got the volume all the way up to 100 on everything. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. I am your Tuesday night delight. I am your Tuesday night reviewer's champion. And I am Mr. Tuesday Night Delight himself, Michael Miner. Please like, comment in the comment section. Um, also, please, if you're out there, please vote. Please try to help me get into the BWC Massacre roster because I would love to become the next world heavyweight champion in BWC. I don't care if I have to start from the bottom. I don't care if I have to start from the cruiser's title. I will start from the bottom and work my way to the top. But, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. I'm sorry for the light quality. If it says that it's something to do with the light quality, I'll let it get. I'll let it fix it. But, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching. I will see you guys next week. Not this week. It's next, not tomorrow, but next, or not tonight, but next Tuesday night. I will see you guys at BWC Massacre. I can't wait for that email to come in saying that I am an officially a BWC Massacre Superstar. If it does, I will do a video on it. I would do a say, big announcement. Um, pretty much thank you, ladies and gentlemen. I am your BWC Tuesday Night Delight, uh, Tuesday Night Reviewers Champion. I am Mr. B Tuesday Night Delight himself, Michael Meyer. And we're going to let you people... Listen to a very good song. It's called From Light a Storm. Like a Storm. It's pretty much a replica of the song from, uh, you know, Coolio that did the song Gangster's Paradise. But this is a rock version. This is my future theme song.